What's going on, everyone? Welcome to Spit It Out Podcast, the podcast of what you've been thinking but haven't actually been hearing. It is your host, Jason Yeser, in the motherfucking building. What's happening, my people? And of course, by my side, I have the baker, the booty shaker, it's Tracy <laughs> Trees. <laughs> Yo, Tracy Trees, what's, what's up? happening? What's up? We're in the building. We in the build. We in the studio. Studio. Let's get that correct. But it's still a building. But it's studio. Studio building. Mm-hmm. Whatever. Whatever floats your boat. What's happening, Trees? What is going on? Man, nothing really. Got a lot of stuff coming up this wait, week. Wait, wait, wait. Did you have your hair done last episode? I have my natural hair. You oh, did so not. I had hair. Oh, and we first got to talk about this because the bitch is looking <laughs> Nice, <laughs> finally. Um, <laughs> about motherfucking time, you know. Shit. Um, the hair's looking nice, but the shirt now, a whole nother oh story. I don't think uh, they can see I, it they that can. much. You guys are just, you know, oh, they can't see the shirt. But you guys are probably just listening now. If you want to watch, of course, YouTube.com slash Jason Yes Sir for the first 20 minutes of every episode. But you're going to go ahead and have to check out her hair. She is looking nice. <laughs> no, it looks really, really nice, though. For real. No, I really like my hair. No, I love my hair. You love it? Yeah, I really like it. It's just the process of me getting it done where I was getting it done that was the most um, Ooh, do you not explain? pleasant experience let's let's talk about it for a little bit why not i you know i wasn't even gonna bring it up but then i just <laughs> get hair reminded me so um we might as well just talk about it for instance so you was getting your hair done and now describe to the people because i know you was texting me um so describe to the people when you arrived what you came across okay so where i thought the guy told me the um where he was gonna break my hair was not nowhere near close to what i thought it was um so I drive up and I'm just sitting there looking. I'm like, okay, it's it's some not bad houses right now. This is fine. And then he was like, it's the, let's say pink for just reference, <laughs> the pink house. And I'm just okay. like, okay. So the pink house had fucking wood on the windows. It was a baby stroller out, like a baby car seat just sitting abandoned. on the my Jesus, it looked bad. And I was like, I literally sent Did I read you that text a text. Correct. <laughs> I sent you a text. I sent Kenyatta. I dropped my pen for Kenyatta. And I um I sent my uh, address, I mean my location to my other yeah. friend. Too. I was like, no, this shit looks crazy as fuck. Like, bruh. Get inside. Oh God, it was just a lot. It was a lot. What was it like? Describe her. So when you first walked inside, because as she mentioned, she did send a, uh, send a text over, and I seen it like later on yeah. in the day. By the time I seen the text, I was like, because hmm, I know we're gonna talk about it in a second too. I know that you're in the process of moving, so I'm like, I know this bitch ain't moving here. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I know that's for oh, sure. Yes, yes. Uh, but I had it. That's the first thing I seen was a picture of a house, and I'm like. Bitch, you sure you said me the right thing? Like, what? And then on the bottom, it was the location. And I'm like, okay, what the fuck is going on? Yeah, bitch yeah. sent me a picture of a house that looked like straight up out of a horror movie. Oh, and yeah, then um, cool. you sent me the location as well. So I'm like, okay, well, something else was But then I was like, oh, she's getting her <laughs> hair done. So describe for us now, what did it look like when you were walking oh. into? Now, did you send a text to them like, hey, I'm outside, meet me outside? How did so that go? So I actually got there 25 minutes early because I thought it was a little oh. further. Okay. So further I, distance. Yeah. Okay. So that's why I left a little early. But it, I was like, "Oh, nigga, you stay ten minutes away." Like, oh, all right. You know, whatever. Uh, uh-uh, ten minutes in that. So damn. I told him, "I'm like, hey, it I'm sure out- changes <laughs> ten minutes out, <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> I send him a text and say, "Hey, I'm outside." And he's. I said, "Hey, I'm outside. I'm a little early. You know, I can chill in the car if you need be." He was like, "Yeah, I'm in. I'm in the bathroom or something like that." Bitch, you in the bathroom for a whole thirty minutes? Like, what are you doing? Because when he came and talked to me, he smelled like he didn't shower. So, I I mean, I don't know. So, he was probably just finished going to number twos. Um, Is that what he smelled like? Or did he smell like sweat, must? Like, what was going on? Describe to us. He just Was it an onion smell? It was just a stinky guy smell. A stinky guy. But, like, like he hasn't washed in days? Like, he hasn't washed in days. Okay. So, I mean, but, okay, so he walked me through the house, which was, you know, very interesting. Then he goes to he gave you a tour? bedroom. Why not? I mean, I had to walk to the living room, dining room. Are you getting a little weird feedback in your ear? No. Oh. Go ahead. 
Maybe it's just me. <laughs> <Go ahead. laughs> Maybe it's just me. <laughs> Wait, did you see that video on social media? Um, the girl had, I guess, the Uber driver had cut off a lady. She's like, "Honey, dear, no, yeah, the fat bitch or something." Like, you never saw that? Oh God, I have to check it out. That's what this. Anyway, everything goes. We digress. Go ahead. Um, oh, fuck. So yeah. I actually he gave you a tour. Oh no, no tour, but just walk into his bedroom. Oh, so I'm just like, okay, and that's where he was doing your hair in his bedroom. In his bedroom. Well, for oh. one, it was I didn't know it was that many people in the house. It was at least six or seven. More okay, so there. describe to us like what is this? We're working with a one bedroom, one bath. What is there? Two bedrooms. Uh, it had one to be. Bath, a, it had to be, like, I hope we're trying to envision this. You know, the people that aren't I am, watching. They don't I am know. thinking maybe like a three one three bedroom, a three bedroom, three bath. Okay. Sorry, three bed. Maybe bedroom. one, one yeah. and a half. That's what I'm. A no, half. I no? doubt if it's a half. No half bath. Oh, oh no, I doubt it. Oh okay. It was a ranch style house, so I'm just okay. like maybe three bedrooms, one bathroom. I'm thinking know. more of a two. Nah, I will hope not to. Well, you had a little tour, so keep going. Anyway, so I begin this room, and the first thing I smell is just yesterday's sex, smoke, and just Oh, because you're in the bedroom. I'm in the bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> what? So wait, 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 let's go back. Let's go. You Yesterday's sex. Mm-hmm. Okay, for one. Then it was smoke. Mm-hmm. Like he smoked cigarettes. So cigarette smoke, mm-hmm. and then roaches like roach smoke, like, like roaches, like roaches. Probably have a smell. roaches. When you have roaches, oh roaches, and oh okay, like, I didn't know roaches, if he was just roaches. smoking off some weed in there. And he had some roaches left behind. Oh no, no, no. Oh okay, so we're talking roaches. We're roaches. talking bugs, roaches, roaches. Okay, keep going. So I'm just like, okay. Then he has the fan just blowing on us. So not only does this room smell like this, but the now face. it just hit me in the face. And it was like at least three times I was the sitting window. there. I'm just crying because my eyes burn so much. So I'm taking my glasses off. I'm trying to get Dry my eyes. eyes. <laughs> <laughs> uh-uh. It smells so bad. And the fan was just hitting me in the face. But it was just like. Did he have a window he could crack? No. He didn't think it smelled. You should have said something. No, that's me. No, you could just be like, "Hey, can I just, you know, I need a breather?" <laughs> <laughs> no, how? What would be the nice way of saying it then? Like, I don't know. That's what I said. This, you can't say nothing, can I, sir. I would just be like, I, I, I prefer like, clap a that window. ass three times. Like, like, I prefer a window opening for circulating the fan. I don't think that's hard. Like, I don't think I don't know. But anyways, if you have it slapping your face, nasty ass funk, like, like just hit me in the face, and then the guy was capping the whole time. Oh my god! It was like Cap City, like. Okay, so then you text me and you was telling me though that you did start seeing the roaches start. <gasps> yes, around. so the roaches were coming out. So I think the first one I saw, I was like watching TV or whatever, because he had like music videos playing and stuff. So I was so, gonna say, what the fuck did he have playing going on? He had music videos playing, which I got a whole bunch of good music. Um, he had music videos playing. Oh, you did because you were telling me he was playing some ratchet ass music. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So anyway, bitch. So. My bad. <laughs> Go ahead. So I'm trying to watch the TV, and then you know how you look outside of your, or you can just see something inside of your eyes. I turned over and I was like, "Oh, he got roaches!" Mind you, I brought my computer back because I was going to do some business work. So I was going to work on a business plan and all mm. that good shit. And then I look up, I was like, "Oh shit, he got roaches!" I'm like, "I got to get my bag off the flow." I was like, "I can't do this." Yeah, definitely. Yeah. So the whole time of him Calling braiding my hair, home, shit. which was four hours, I had my little computer bag just sitting on my lap the whole time and i was just like oh my god i would be so nervous though like for to crawl on me while i'm down there because you was able to see your feet i wasn't even yeah i wasn't thinking about that like i had my feet up pretty much the whole time like was you wearing like open toed clothes no it was cold i had my uggs on oh yeah okay okay Okay, so you was well protected Mm -hmm. oh but just imagine if they would have got in the ugg who I didn't want to think of that. That's, nasty. That's mad work to get it out, right? Uh, <laughs> throw the whole boot uh, uh, away. Uh, a no roach rug, in your ugh. Ain't um, no rug, man. Yeah, no. Uh, uh-uh. uh. So yeah, you were telling me all this. I'm sounding like this sounds like the worst scenario can possibly be because yeah. you're there. You're figuring you're getting your hair done. Mm-hmm. You're hoping it's decent, it's nice. You're gonna be sitting there for quite a while. You said oh, like God, yeah. three to four hours or so. Came so you in took, like, what, room. Three and a half, crazy. four hours. You said right. Four, yeah, three and a half, four hours. See, and you in that type of vibe. So his sister came in the room too. The little sister doing what? She was just she playing was Barbies. Like, she she was like, "Hi." She had the little dirty feet, dirty oh, hands. Girl, don't even. No, I'm just saying that's. And I was just like, "Oh, poor baby." And then he was like, "Leave her alone," and he closed the door. Watch your feet. <laughs> uh, uh, so was the whole house just dirty? Yes. Oh, okay. And they were just dirty people. So you had someone dirty work on your hair. I mean, I your hair don't look I dirty, don't though, girl. I don't want to talk about him because I, you know, no, I know, I get it. Again. He 
but I, it's just like. It was just a very interesting, you know. It's interesting, and I get it, too. You know, everyone's trying to make their dollars, so that might be the only place where he can make it at. But you would hope that if you're trying to bring business in, you're bringing him. You know, or say you travel, and nigga, meet me at my house and bring your equipment. Like, that would have been cool, too. If you meet me in the hotel lobby, I would like, do it man, there, too. Like, somewhere that don't get uh-uh. roaches, preferably, but, you know. Well, good for you. If I would have rolled up to that, I probably would have been like, how bad do I need my hair done? But I mean, he, it was a deal. It was a steal. A deal of a steal. Oh my okay. god! It was great. I see why. You know. I you see know, why. Some consequences. You, you got a deal. With. You know. You, know? you deal with what you deal with. Take I get the deal it. With the but hey, it looks good. The hair came out nice and everything. I, I don't see a roach in sight. So bitch, <laughs> 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 it's looking good. Uh uh. So also, we're gonna talk about you moving because we mentioned it a little earlier, and also we were just talking earlier. You were starting to pack and all that. So how's that coming oh along? You're packing now. You're not moving very far. You're moving. No, yeah. So we're, we're moving. Down, so. Yeah, a couple doors down from where I am. But just now. the packing process. And I literally just start packing today. Like, and I yeah, literally. And you got to be out there, but in how many days? Wednesday. So when this but episode my, comes out, so in two days because we're recording early. Spoiler. Yeah. Yeah, so my shit's days, pretty good though. Out. Yeah, my shit's pretty good. It's their shit that you know. I'm gonna pack up the kitchen whenever I get home tomorrow. And so then, you got it pretty easy, simple. Yeah, no, I have a that. setup. My bedroom shit is my bedroom shit. Bathroom with the bathroom shit. When it's time to go on that day, just pack up the shit that's actually in the tub, and you're done. True. So yeah, if you don't have that much stuff either, but even the mo- moving process mm-hmm. is always nice because you're able to. See what you have. See mm-hmm. things that you don't use exactly. no more. That you no longer need. Get Speaking rid of the Speaking of clutter. that, you trying to help me move? <laughs> 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 Who are you talking to, girl? Oh, wow. You talking to the audience, right? Hey, guys, listeners, if you are looking to help Treasy Trees move, um, what do you need help with, though? Bitch, I have so many clothes and shoes. How am I going to help you? I'll come pick you up in the morning, and then, you know, we'll make it a couple fun four or five hours. Oh, that's fine. I'll treat you to lunch. I'll buy you lunch. Yeah, Take no, that's for everybody. No, I'm just joking. no, that's really fun. I don't mind. And then you, you know get to see a new place. That's fine. That's cool. It's not that far. Home. It's literally right around the corner. It's yeah. like the same complex. So I I can do. I can manage. Um, but no, get around the clutter, cl- cl- clutter, and all of that. So did you like realize a lot of stuff that you, oh I'm getting God. rid of? I don't need this. I did. I made a Salvation Army bag, or okay. um, you know how they have those like a donation little, pile. Yeah, a donation yeah. pile. And I was like, God, I don't wear half this shit, and it just sits in my closet. I didn't. I gave at least three pair brand happens. new heels. Three pair of brand new heels. I was just like, uh-uh. I don't use this shit. Like, they gonna be styling. So they got a lot of stuff. I yeah. threw away some t-shirts. Or not threw away, but I gave away some t-shirts. No jeans. I haven't done it in a while, but I've even before gave things away with still like tags on. Same. <laughs> Same. That's what I'm saying. Like, I'm just like, I'm just I've never, never wore wear. this before. Or I put it on and I'm like, this don't fit right or yeah. I don't like how it looks. And it's like, can't do nothing. I can't return yeah. it or nothing. Yeah. And it's not worth give trying it away, to like yeah. sell it. Like a cheap old mm-hmm. t shirt or something like that. Yeah. Uh, but then it's also sometimes you find some good things that like you forgot about and it's like, oh shit, I got this. I yeah. forgot about this too. So Nobody had that yet. Mm-mm. You haven't done that yet? <laughs> Haven't had that experience. Haven't came yet. across that at all. Um, <laughs> but that's like that Netflix show that everyone would be talking about that Maria Kondo or whatever her name Mm-mm. is. That she, um, it's about cluttering and people that are hoarder stuff. Mm-hmm. Um, and suppose like if it, her saying what it, i haven't seen it mm-hmm. but um if it doesn't bring you joy then get oh, rid of it i seen a family guy episode about that okay so yeah it's a like lot a of people were Chinese talking about this lady or something? yeah and i guess they watch it with subtitles i don't know if even it think. doesn't bring you joy and you need to get rid of it or something like that yeah. oh family guy definitely made a so on that. that's, funny. that's what you have to go through your stuff and if it doesn't bring you joy you get rid of it if it brings you joy you keep it nah bro no Cause so what I do got, you say in your I head then? Like, tags, am I going to use this? Like, oh, this can possibly bring me joy. Like, that's to be the purpose. So what goes through your head then when you're making the process of, do I keep if it? If I can out? fit it, if I can't fit it, how much work will it take me to fit <laughs> to this? Fit and I'm just like, you know, someone she was like, I'm not going to get back into yeah. this 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 medium right here. Let's just throw this away. Okay. Like, nah. And then if just in, things yeah, like senior like, days already. And then already shoes, just, I'm just sitting there like, um... I don't. I know I'm not gonna wear these. This is not a me shoe. It's usually a shoe that somebody brought me because I think heels are the hardest thing to get me. Like, uh, it's just hard. I just don't recommend anybody to buy me heels. But, um, yeah, I was just looking at like I'm yeah. not gonna wear this again, or you know, let me give this away. So I was just like, this is I don't know. 
as long Plus, as I didn't want to keep trucking all that shit. That's yeah. As long as it's in con- good condition, yeah. you might as well try to see if you can go ahead and give it away to someone and donate because that's mm-hmm. the better thing to do instead of yeah. just throwing it into the garbage. I couldn't stand like when people just throw things into the garbage or what I can't get is what the companies do and demolish all their shit or cut things up or whatever that's instead of donating me. it. It's like yeah. for nobody or able to use it. Yeah, and it's like you're throwing it away anyways. Make might as well make good use out of it so at least you are able to donate um and give it to the people you know less fortunate or even not even less fortunate it's just people that would yeah. use it as second hand thrift stores it goes mm-hmm. even like goodwill they resell it yeah that's the only thing i don't really care for though like now they're making a profit off of your stuff so you oh, can yeah, donate goodwill. to places where they can't really make a profit unless you sell it somewhere and then you can always claim it on your taxes oh well that's yeah. still good that's a perk you can do that if you was to donate stuff you can also get and have them give you a receipt for the stuff you donated Mm -hmm. and then you could claim it all in your taxes but that's a whole nother process to go through and everything yeah so it's really if you want to deal with all of that um speaking of the less uh less fortunate and all um so this homeless there's been like big ass homeless attacks in la right really you haven't heard about this? Mm-mm. So this one is crazy. A woman was punched in the head and then she got fucking shit diarrhea poured on her head. Hot diarrhea is the way they described it by a homeless person. And they're just doing like these random acts of violence. Like they white. They, no, it's like all different types of homeless girl. It isn't just like, oh, it's a white thing or not. It's like just some random ass homeless people in L.A. going after random civilians. Oh, wait. Oh, so. Oh, oh, OK. Wait. Okay. Wait, did I, so, you got confused? I got confused. I thought these were regular people doing this to homeless people. No, 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 but no. These are the homeless opposite. people. Oh, that's the It's the opposite. Oh, it wasn't disgusting the other way before. No, it was. But this is making it extra was that disgusting. It? Now it's extra disgusting. How is it extra oh, disgusting? God. Homeless people are people, too. No. Yes, of course. But so how is it extra disgusting? Oh man, girl! Because they're homeless, you don't know what they got. You don't know what's going on. Like, it's crazy. I yeah. mean, either so, way, it's disgusting. It was um un- unexpected woman, unsuspecting woman in Los Angeles. She was pulled out of her vehicle and dragged into the street by a person, who then proceeded to douse her with a bucket of hot diarrhea. Who just carrying around diarrhea? <laughs> And hot, like how are they? And hot, is it just are they keeping it warm? Like, like, what are they doing? I guess it's just sitting in the LA sun and is warming up, or are they like physically <laughs> warming it up? Like, I, I don't know, I don't get it. But also, too, what a description! Like, they couldn't just say diarrhea; they had to say hot diarrhea. So, but not only Maybe did she get dragged out of her vehicle, but like you fucking punched her in the head. And then also did that too. They and they stole something. They had to steal something, right? I don't know. Pushed her in front of a moving truck. Like, oh my god, poor lady. She gonna be traumatized for life. She never gonna walk down the street. Mm-mm. And this is, I think, like attacks happening random times of the day to like middle of the day. So not even like, oh, you know, don't go down there <laughs> at night. Like, the homeless people go get you. Uh, uh, forget throwing getting like pissed on her. Not gotta that worry about hot on. diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta worry about how that really cost that you poured on her head. Can you imagine, bitch? Oh my god, your hair would be done. <laughs> it's no more hair. It's no more head at this point, bitch. You gonna you see gonna, you gonna shave? Down. I'm gonna be like um Powerpuff Girls, Miss um what's her name? Bitch. So would you just shave your head? Or would you wash, yes. wash, deep condition? I would condition. shave my head. It has to go. It, it, all, start has, from it sh- all has to go. Start from fresh and bleach. Oh my you, I'm goodness. gonna look. I'm gonna smell like bleach for like a week. Oh, I feel bad for the lady. Mm. But also, too, it says she got dragged out of the vehicle. I wonder if she got physically dragged out of the vehicle. Bitch, why are you, why are your doors unlocked? Also, I want to know, like, because I don't feel like she got dragged out of the vehicle. <laughs> this, exactly. this might be wrong, but I don't know if she got dragged out of the vehicle. I feel like she might Flag have, on the play. I feel like she might have came out of the vehicle on her own willing. Was there any like type of footage or was it just I don't the think there article? was footage. I got it off of like a Twitter trending oh. Twitter moment or something mm-hmm. like that. And I hate to say like no, I don't believe it that she got dragged. She could have got dragged, who knows, cuz she got hit by a moving truck, got punched in the head. So it does does sound kind of violent, but I don't know about the whole situation mm-hmm. like well, no, you could get dragged out of the car. Let me just stop. Okay. I'm like, okay, <laughs> where are we going? But I feel like, because I, when I first, I think I was thinking she came out of the car, like maybe to like give him a dollar or something, and then that happened. You know what I mean? Mm. But she got dragged. She was probably at a red like stoplight or something. Okay, maybe. How does this make sense to you? 
I mean, it don't. It don't at all. I was like, okay. I still can't get over the hot diarrhea. <laughs> this is disgusting. That is disgusting. Okay, we're going to go commercial. We'll be back, guys. We have a lot more things to talk about. We have an actual game to play. Um, that's going to be coming up. We have a bunch of questions to get through. Some spicy questions. Some spicy questions. What is it? Sultry, sexy questions. Um, No, we have a couple of things to get into, and you guys are going to love it. Don't want to miss. Uh, yeah, we'll be right